This dandelion says, I ain't coming out in the cold yet. You're crazy. Funny how the weeds have flowers just as pretty as anything else. Dogs, what are y'all doing? Being good, Lenny? And there goes Highway. Pretty berries. Hmm. Not gonna eat them. My grandpa said, if the birds ain't eating them, you don't wanna eat them. <laughs> huh. Poppy's open. Now we have something very pretty here. That's pretty. And I got a dog. Camera hog. Camera hog dog. Are y'all camera hog dogs? Silly puppies eating grass. Dogs will eat grass to uh, settle their stomach. Or to induce vomiting or they just... They like doing it. They don't need a reason. Didn't mean to drop my camera. I'm sorry, when weeds are pretty like this, I say let them grow. That's just gorgeous. Even when folks abandon a home, the legacy of their plant gardens remain. There's a rose bush here too, ready to grow. See the buds. It's gonna make some pretty roses. And of course the dogs like them. <laughs> boys, boys. The neighbors' uh, azaleas are really in bloom today. It's beautiful. That was an azalea I showed you just before the rose rose buds. I miss, the, I miss the azaleas when I lived in Savannah. People ask me, what do you miss the most about Savannah? I have to tell them that the most I miss are the squares, the city squares and the azaleas and the Spanish moss. I miss all that. Azalea up close. They're only with us for a short time each year, but they sure are worth the, the wait and the sight when they come out. These flowers are just microscopic. Tiny, tiny flowers growing here amongst the clover. Hey boys. Pretty. Dogwood. Out with the dogs looking at flowers and come upon a dogwood. <laughs> this is past the flowering phase, but this is the loquat. The leaves can be dried out, ground up and made into a tea that uh, uh, normalizes your blood sugar. Type 2 diabetics and diabetics used to use this in China uh, to help keep their sugar regulated. I think they still do. Works good. The fruit when it's mature and turns bright yellow, it, uh, the seeds are poison. But the fruit isn't so bad. I take the fruit and put it in smoothies and things. It's not bad at all. My neighbor has pink azaleas. And glorious white ones as well. I'm gonna have to plant me some azalea bushes. I see that now. Not really wildflowers. Get out of there, Lenny. 
but the uh, neighbor here across the street planted these looks kind of like a showroom setup for this house that's for sale and uh, anyway they're still pretty even though they're not really wild at all I like it though when I find an abandoned house that's still got its wild, its flowers have gone wild, feral or whatever in, on the garden grounds. It's nice when you find something like that.